Hi, I'm the Miserable Gamer, and welcome back to Hellblade's The Newer Sacrifice. Um, now, if you caught the little previous episode, we um, we were following Dylan, or the manifestation of Dylan, um, and we followed him to this tree, which is pretty. All those flayed people hanging up there. How lovely. And, um, yeah, we had the, the visions of the of the pretty fields and things like that. So, let's see where we go from here. Are we gonna see any well oh, there's a circle over there for us to have a look at. Let's pick up the pace. Death for Sigmund and his brother seems certain. But the king's wife is Sigmund's sister, and she begs for mercy and implores the king to chain them up instead. He agrees. Not for mercy, though, but because he plans an even more cruel and lingering death. Chained to a tree in the forest that night, a she-wolf comes and devours one of Sigmund's brothers. She returns, ravenous, night after night, until only Sigmund is left. The next day, Sigmund's sister sends a servant with honey to smear on Sigmund's face. But to what end? Well, that night, when the she-wolf appears again, you'll never guess what happens. I'm not quite sure if this is meant for anything. Circle of stones. See another story over there. As the she wolf licks the sweet honey from Sigmund's face, he bites the wolf's tongue. The she wolf pulls away, but Sigmund holds on. The chains break, and he is free. After his escape, Sigmund lives like us, hidden in the forest. His enemy, King Sigir, believing him dead, as his sister plots revenge. And for vengeance to succeed, even the great Sigmund needs help. So she sends her sons to him. But their blood is weak and corrupted, and they're put to death by Sigmund. So his sister hatches a new plan, one that is cold of heart and pure of blood. Okay. But I say, like, that tide, the waves coming in there is very well done, isn't it? That's almost photorealistic. It really is, pr really is pretty. Well, I guess we're going to the tree. Oh, she's finally all okay. A new sword. That looks like a new Take sword. A sword. Take it. Tell him left it for you. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. <laughs> <laughs> Talking to me now. The sword appears whole, but it is an illusion. It shattered into shards long ago. It is said a great warrior can reforge grammar by answering the trials of Odin, one for each shard. The roots of the tree of death 
will take you to new lands where you will face the trials. Go to the shards. Go to the shard. Go to the shards. What's the shard? Find it. It's the metal. It's in front of you. Find it. The metal. The runes. You need it. Right, okay, so I can't take the sword yet. So what have I gotta to do to take the sword? It's all these circles, that. Where is it? Find, Find it. it. There it is. Focus. There's the shot. Focus. Focus. Use your eyes. Look. Get closer. A king in the north forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust, and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn. And it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword Tyrving. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? It feels wrong. Where are we now? Where the hell are we? So strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. She can follow the flags. So very ordinary. Inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes and forces itself onto our friends or loved ones. Then comes the reckoning. Sorry, that's my phone going off. I haven't put it on silent. There we go. That's on. Do not disturb. Right, where are we going to go in here? It's a burial hill, is it? I can't fight anything, I don't have a sword. Dillian, I'm here. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? Nothing down there. What's wrong? What happened? Can you hear me? Just wait there. I'll find you. You have to find him. This is your mission. Find him. You have to use everything you have and find him. Get him back. He's just there. How could you lose him? How could she lose him? How could she find him? I can't go through there. It's very dark. I'll find him. What's that? Did you hear that? Nothing. What's that voices? Don't touch the walls. You don't know what they might do. Turn back. She has to keep going. It's not safe here. She has to keep going. Find another way. It's not working. You have to use your mind. Where can you go? You're failing. Find another Think. way. Think. 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 Focus. Think. Use your mind. Where's he gone? He's disappeared. You Look. have to slip through the fields. I can hear him. The story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. Her name is Herver, the daughter of a berserker born after he was killed. She's a wild, willful child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. 
When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrvin. So that's one of these never-ending corridor. They keep looping around on each other until you find the right way. join a band of warriors, and soon becomes their leader. When they come to the island where her father is buried, her men do not want to go ashore. They say that evil haunts the island, and that it is a worse place by day than other places are by night. Fearless, she lands alone. There are many grave mounds, and all of them have ghostly flames burning over them. She comes to the grave mound of her father, after passing through these ghostly fires, as though they were mist. The flames I passed through were real enough. Damn the Northmen to hell. So you can't walk too far away from those story stones, because... Um, they fade out. circles again. <laughs> Where are we? She has no idea. We're going round and see. You have fallen in. You think that sound is Dillian's voice? It's a trap. <laughs> you walked right into there. They have you right where they want you. Now I'm going to try following the... How could you? <laughs> well, that's changed. That wasn't... I'm going to try following the sound.
Hmm. I'm not sure if I'm meant to be going backwards or forwards now. Oh, this is different. No, that's the main entrance where I came out. Right, I'm going to try following the noises. Definitely this way. This way. This way. Definitely this way. This looks very different. Okay, so that's what he has to do through there was follow the sounds. He wants me to find him. I'm lost without him. That voice. It's not Dillian. Definitely not Dillian. I'm leaving. I've decided. I think it will be good for me. It's the darkness. It's speaking through No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it. In my own way. I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy. Chief, no. He 
said he could help me. It's a trick. He said it could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. No. You will not defy the gods. Come, child, take my hand. Come, send one. No! I am leaving! You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! Okay, so that's the first trial. And I'm going to leave that there, keep it nice and short. So, this is the trials of Turving. Turing? Turving? Turving. I'll have to look up to see what the actual. I'm sure it says Turving. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that. Please hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't already. And there's notifications with a little bell icon to make sure you get informed of new videos that I put out. And you can find me on Twitter. I'm at miserable underscore gamer. And Facebook is forward slash miserable gamer, all one word. Leave me a comment below. Let me know how you think I'm doing. Great to hear from you guys. Thanks again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye. So it's one of these never-ending corridor. They keep looping around on each other until you find the right way. warriors, and soon becomes their leader. When they come to the island where her father is buried, her men do not want to go ashore. They say that evil haunts the island, and that it is a worse place by day than other places are by night. Fearless, she lands alone. There are many grave mounds, and all of them have ghostly flames burning over them. She comes to the grave mound of her father, after passing through these ghostly fires, as though they were mist. The flames I passed through were real enough. Damn the Northmen to hell. So you can't walk too far away from those story stones, because, um... You, they fade out. that one. I've gone back round in circles again. Hmm. Now this 
this looks different. Or is it? You follow the flags. So very ordinary. Inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes and forces itself onto our friends or loved ones, then comes the reckoning. Sorry, that's my phone going off. I haven't put it on silent. There we go. That's on. Do not disturb. Why are we gonna go in here? It's a burial hill, is it? I can't fight anything, I don't have a sword. Dillian, I'm here. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? Nothing down there. What's wrong? What happened? Can you hear me? Just wait there. I'll find you. You have to find him. This is your mission. Find him. You have to use everything you have and find him. Get him back. He's just there. How could you lose him? How could she lose him? How could she find him? I can't go through there. It's very dark. I'll find him. <gasps> What's that? <gasps> Did you hear that? Nothing. What's that voices? It's not me. Don't touch the walls. You don't know what they might do. Turn back. <sighs> she has to keep going. It's not safe here. She has <gasps> to keep going. Find another way. It's not working. You'll have to use your mind. Where can you go? You're failing. Find another think. way. Think. 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 Focus. Think. Use your mind. Where's he gone? He's disappeared. You look. Slip through the fields. I can hear him. Think clearly. The story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. This way. <gasps> Definitely this way. looks very different. Okay, so that's what he has to do through there was follow the sounds. He wants me to find him. I'm lost without him. That voice. It's not Dillian. Definitely not Dillian.
wants me to face my fears. Okay, so I can't take the sword yet. So what have I got to do to take the sword? Right, there's all these circles, look. Like. forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn and it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword Tyrving. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? It feels wrong. Where are we now? Burial man. Where the hell are we? So strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. She can follow the flags. So very ordinary. Inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death. Because we have no answer for it. But when it comes and forces itself onto our friends or loved ones, then comes the reckoning. Sorry, that's my phone going off. I haven't put it on silent. There we go. That's on. Do not disturb. Where are we gonna go in here? It's a burial hill, is it? Well, I can't fight anything. I don't have a sword. <laughs> Where are we? She 
has no idea. <laughs> We're going round and see. You have fallen in. You think that sound is Dillian's voice? It's a trap. <laughs> you walked right into their hands. They have you right where they want you. Oh, I'm going to try following the... How could you? <laughs> well, that's changed. That wasn't... I'm going to try following the sound. I'm leaving. I've decided. I think it will be good for me. It's the darkness. It's speaking through. No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it in my own way. I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy. Chief, no. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said it could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. No. You will not defy the gods. Come, child, take my hand. Come. Send one. No! I am leaving! You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! Alright, okay, so... That's the first trial. I'm gonna leave